Sophia, and I'm a kid just like you, and you, and you, and you, and you. Yeah, I'm a kid just like all of you. Everybody's a kid. Woo. -hoo. Okay, and today we're going to be talking about the Civil War. Civil War so far. Slavery! Boop, boop. Civil War leaders. Whoa, is that Robert E. Lee? That's so cool. <laughs> and... Dun, 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 dun. Major battles! So first we're going to be talking about slavery. Bring in the pick. Come on. Oh, no, we, we don't want you, Robert E. Lee. Get out. Okay, now we have slavery. Let's do it. Okay, let's start. Hey, as you may know, slavery is very bad. Switch the pick. Okay, there we go. Does anyone know what slavery means? Anybody? You're right, it means that white people sell blacks as property and they would work all day with little or no pay for the whites. The slave masters would whip them if they weren't working. They were forced to do it. Did you know what some of the slaves did? Yeah, they ran away to the north during the war that the South, the South had slavery, but the North didn't. Next up, major dun, 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 battles. Woo, woo, woo. The first and second battle of Bull Run are the most known battles in the Civil War. But let's just talk about the first one. Number one, the first battle of Bull Run. People would sit by the creek, bull run, they bring their picnic, and they watch the fight. How funny is that? Uh, that's hilarious. <laughs> Number two, the Siege of Vicksburg. This battle gave control to the Union to cut off Confederate supplies on the Mississippi River. Number three. Chancellorsville was where General Stonewall Jackson met his death. I guess it was just his time to go. Those are just a few of the major battles of the Civil War. Now, moving on. Moving to Robert E. Lee. I know you're excited, but you're not supposed to be on the screen right now. Next up, Civil War leaders. Number one, Abraham Lincoln. He was a bold man fighting for the Union. He was the president of the North. And he was a very good man. Do you know who was president in the Confederate? Yeah, Jefferson Davis. He was a slave owner of 113 slaves. Very bad. Number three, George B. McClellan. He was a union man fighting for what was right, but even so, he was very demanding and petty. Last but certainly not least, Robert E. Lee, a proud Confederate commander that was brave, bold, and hardworking. Thanks for watching. Please come again.